Hello everyone, welcome back. We are here in our spawn area in our farm and we are going to continue to see what we did this week. It, it's uh, not a lot. We haven't been or I haven't been playing um, much in, in the room. Uh, neither has the kids. We, we've all been busy in IRL. So uh, yeah, but uh, let me just show you guys what we've done or what I've done this week. Just the small uh, things here and there. Let's start off in this area. So we terraformed everything here. We reduced all of this hill down to this level. And uh, there's a little bit of moss. That's what that's the method that we used to uh, remove all this um, all this terrain. There was a mountain right here. You can see there's a little bit more uh, stone and some coal that I haven't picked up. Right here we got a, a lot of sand and some sandstone. And over there that hill as well. We reduced it between this this hill and this mound over here. There was a little pond in the middle of it. This was covered up. So we might do something with that. I uh, also wanted to have this area clear so that we can see this side of the river and that side of the river. And as well, there's an entry point right here in between these two land uh, masses, which over here is where we have our spawn area on my house, the kids' house, and the, the brand new portal that uh, we made. Yes, we are heading to the nether. Not today. I'm not going to record there, but uh, maybe soon. But yeah, I wanted to have this area clear because right here is an entry point from the sea to um uh to go around the this island this is an island where we're at so um yeah when i want it visible i want it clear so that you can see from this side to that side of the river over there and this is the, the main area right here where we have this clover um it was going to be saint patrick's day and noah wanted to uh celebrated by uh putting a clover somewhere in the world so i decided to make a pixel art and put it in the gaming district so we are gonna have some games here for everyone to play with or to play in uh and like we moved the um the parkour that i had here we are going to place it somewhere on that side so and then we can add more uh, I also want to add a trail from here, the central area, uh, make a, make something uh, circular and make a path around it and head this way, going towards our bridge and maybe on that side, going towards the farm, a small little patch of uh, dirt and then a main road going towards the village that way. So that is the plan for this area, but I needed all this to be flat um i was gonna try to build on top of you know the the natural terrain but for what we wanted to do we wanted it visible from all sides um and i kind of do like coming from the village and uh seeing the seeing the farm over here how it looks it looks really nice and seeing the, the big heart uh, there so that that's nice it's, it symbolizes something that so it symbolizes that we're home you know, once you, once you see the heart, it symbolizes that we're home. So let's exit the gaming district or the gaming area, future gaming area. And we go to the tree house and our homes We to see what we've added. There's not much. It's just like, you know, simple decorate, decorative thing and organization and stuff like that. But we did progress in that area. So let's go to the tree house and to uh, our area over there. Oh, wait, but before I forget, did I ever introduce you to my friend here, Polly? Polly, this is everyone, everyone, Polly. Yeah, we got a parrot now. Uh, I've been uh, feeding some of the parrots, or not parrots, but I fed this one, and some of the animals will show you 
later uh, at the end of the video. We get a horse, we got uh, we got um, pandas, and I got a parrot. This is Polly. We just got to get a name tag. Well, you know what? We'll do that right now. Let's go up uh, the house. Uh, just to start off, we I, I had uh, some carpet on me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oops, oops, oops. So I got had some carpet on me, and um, I put it down here, right in the center, going from the bed over here to this area, like uh, instead of a red carpet, it's the green carpet, and uh, it goes very well with my area. I like it. I like it a lot. It makes it pop, but it stays in this, you know, jungle theme. I, I like it. So we have organized a little bit more. There's not a lot of. Um, there's more junk in our there's more junk in the trunk and um that we need to organize so we needed a lot of more space on this side over here as you can tell i added more uh chests and i moved some stuff from here all this that's my map my map box now i moved it all over here to this side so it can be more organized i got my dirt cobble and and the random uh, decorative blocks like you know gravel I mean sorry granite diorite and the side all them and we left this, these areas open so we can climb up and down uh, our tree and right over here so we can go to our secondary spot up here mm -hmm. so you can easy access to this area to our treasures and our goodies right there and our this is our bedroom up here which we are going to continue adding more but for now this is uh we need more storage getting more items we got my moss over here and back back here we got more chests that we can you know uh add more stuff to um pretty much organizing pruning all the chests that i leave around from different projects and i uh consolidating them to one area right here on my uh, treehouse. So that's my that's the treehouse. Oh oh, another thing, I've been working on these maps. So um, hopefully, I can in the next video. I really would like to uh, have a map area. Oh, I think I just threw it up. And uh, let's see. Okay, so this is the farm area. I think this is the next part next to this. All right, this will go right here. And there you go. That's the bridge. You can see the bridge there. That's our farm. Or you can see the wool. It looks nice. It looks that that rainbow cut. That rainbow is is nice. And you got the cherry, uh, the cherry wood area of our farm. Let's see the next. So this and this is the gaming area. The gaming map. It it um. It's the second part as well of the farm, so I'm gonna make a map area one one of these days, and I'll show you guys in the next episode. So let's put these back, so we don't lose these maps, and we have them nice uh, and safe right here in our chest. These are not gonna be in the same chest as our treasure maps. Our treasure maps are up there because those are for loot and for future exploration. Or whenever we need to do that so let's go i need to name you buddy as well as well as polly um down there as you guys can see micah uh was playing one of these days and decided to extend his uh his entrance to his from his house all the way to the beach so we might give him a citation, but maybe not. So yeah, let's check this out. I mean, he got pranked as well. Not pranked, but uh, maybe one day we'll, we'll we'll come in here and continue remodeling his house. This is his kitchen. I don't know if I've ever showed it in the video, but this is the kitchen that I kind of carved out. And that's like a little bar, but we're going to... Uh, later uh, remove these blocks and replace them with more decorative blocks more uh, other nice stuff so I'll throw over, over here if we continue this hallway you can tell there's a bunch of colors uh, I, I, uh, 
not pranked him, but I came in here with a bunch of wool and just started putting a lot of colors around his house. Uh, it wasn't a prank because he kind of liked it. He kind of liked all of these colors, so he's like, I want more. And then he didn't, he wanted more color in his bedroom, so you're probably going to use these colors here. Might turn them into banners or might integrate them into the walls. So maybe that, that would look cool. Threw some, a bunch of colors all over here. He loved it. So not, not a prank, not a prank, right? So it looks pretty cool from outside. It looks like gumballs, to, like the gumball machine from outside that room. So that looks cool. I like that. <laughs> that that's pretty funny. Um, so we've been hard at work chopping down trees, getting um, more logs and more things. We already went to the nether and uh, apparently we are in a biome where the, uh, those, the trees, the nether trees come out. Sorry, I don't know the names. But so we're going to obtain those logs as well. And uh, we already made a section over here for these azalea uh, fl flowered flowering az azaleas and the others. So now we need just the leaves and to complete that. And where is going to be our mangrove? Right, I think here. Now we need to get our mangrove log. So maybe at the end of the, the, the video, we will go in, in exploration. You guys, uh, I'll bring you along just to the journey just to find it. And um, we'll end the episode there. Or I'll end it before I'll take off. And um, you guys get to see a time lapse at the end of that. So, oh before we end this video this is or this episode i guess uh we made some friends hopefully we can find them let me go look for them they are two pandas um we uh found the the panda with a little booger so we named i named him a boogie woogie um and I just need to look for it. So, and then uh, we found an, a secondary, a second panda. There's one. Hopefully that's, that's it. And let's see if it's it. Who are you? Oh, you're, you, oh, I don't know you. You don't have your tongue out? Because we also found another one. And uh, that one's called Roly Poly. So we got two pandas, Roly Poly and uh, boogie Woogie. Boogie Woogie has a little booger in his face, in his, in his nose, and uh, Roly Poly loves to roll around, so that's that's where the names came from. Um, you guys have not seen them, Noah and, and Micah have not seen them either. Hopefully I can find them, they're hiding somewhere around here. I name tagged them as well, and if we can't find them, I'll show you guys the picture. I did take a, a screenshot and shared it to the realm of the board. Didn't know that these realms came with that. Let's see. Let's see if we can find one of these pandas. If not, I'm going to have to show you. There was one down here the other day. One of them got lost down here. Let's see if I can find them. Dang it. Oh, no. No, it's more up. More up here. There's a crater somewhere. They could have easily gone in there too. And I wanted to trap them. But I'd rather see them in, out in the open. Roaming and roaming uh, free. So we don't we don't have them in captivity. Since we do live in a jungle biome. Oh, let's see that one down there. Hopefully they didn't go down there. And uh panda panda panda. Uh, nope. So yeah, those are our two new pandas. Welcome to the realm, guys. So they're going to be roaming around the world somewhere. If you find them, you see them, take a picture. And uh, yeah, post it on the bulletin board, guys. To no one, Mike, if you guys are watching this. <laughs> so I'm going to come real quick over here to Noah's house. 
Uh, I don't know if I've shown this, but this is pretty cool. This is a secret new house right here. And uh, this is his home. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I like how he's uh, making it his own. I like all those uh, organization, all the chests, and he's being more organized. So that's pretty cool. Um, I wanted to make him a bigger area, so I carved out this side. It's the same type of deal as over here. We just need some more banners, and I am currently uh, mapping it out. There's going to be a map right here to mimic uh, on that side. He has a map where he has like a little they would see over there on that side there's a display case where he wanted to put armor stands or them themselves to play like dolls or whatever like mannequins and we're still working on this and over here i kind of added a lot of uh, mossy uh moss blocks on the walls to make it look more green made this little arch on either side and we might carve this out down downstairs or Straight, so we don't know yet so over here is another area that i'm still working on expanding his house to to uh have more room and like over here he hit this side he has his storage area a bigger one and he has a window uh to the mine to the main mine shaft um which also we are going to work on that in the future i want to expand it make it better Maybe put a rail, uh, uh, rail down, going down and up, so we can bring up all of our uh, ores and you know diamonds and all that other stuff. So that is Noah's house. What we worked on on his shop, it's pretty much the same. <clears throat> it's it's uh, thing the same. Maybe just the, the floor changed to simulate a play uh, YouTube play button but he has all his stuff he has here stored so if we need anything we can come and ask um, and he will provide us with whatever we need you know so anything anything that we want to donate we bring it here and anything we want to order we ask him and maybe he has it and uh, yeah See, so he was pick up I don't know if someone ordered pork chops maybe it was Micah and uh, this is things that he got donated. Let's see, he got donated a salmon, a uh, puffer fish, a lily pad, a, a stick, and yellow wool, and some leather pants. Uh, yeah, you stand up. Let's go. So yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Um, oh, I also, Micah got mail over here. I don't think he's seen it so I went on exploration and I gave him a one of these banners I got gave him a golden apple that I found I also gave Noah one gave him some iron some redstone and gave him some amethyst shards as well gave him some cookies you can't go wrong with cookies spore blossom something nice I found I got three of them I gave one to each. Gave him a saddle because he's been wanting a horse, a horsey, and some armor so he can uh, armor that uh, that stallion up. We got a cauldron as well. He he really wanted a cauldron, so I provided him with iron and got him a cauldron. So that's cool, cool. Let's see what else is there to to let you know about that we've done. Maybe just a portal as well, but you already talked about that so pretty much that's it um i'll leave you guys here to this one it's been a short uh week we on uh, minecraft we have not played as much like that we wanted to we've just been super super busy and uh actually this one's on the fly i recorded and uploaded this at the same day so forgive me if i'm kind of rushed it's just uh i really haven't had any time so i'm gonna leave you guys because I really do need to get that mangrove, uh, that mangrove uh, sapling, so I can grow more of those mangrove trees. I really do want to finish up my collection of trees in Minecraft, so I want I need to go explore those and uh, and and uh, 
can get at least one. The good part is I'm going to use these cheat features, the, the, the ones that we have in place, like keep our inventory. Uh, I'm going to use that to my benefit. So I'm going to just get there, get the, get the sapling and dip out and, uh, and spawn back here at home, uh, back to our house. So we're going to leave it there, guys. Thank you guys for tuning into my video and checking what we've been doing this week. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. Go enjoy it. Go have some fun. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Mucho amor. Hasta luego. Bye. We've done it. We have done it. We have found the mangrove swamp and we have one of these saplings, the mangrove saplings. Now it's time to go home and we're going to go out in the bang. See you guys next time. Bye. Awkward.